Big Bird. Mr. Hooper's not coming back. Why not? Big Bird, when, when people die, they don't come back. Ever? No, never. Well, it won't be the same. You're right, Big Bird. It's, it's, it'll never be the same around here without him. But you know something? We can all be very happy that we had a chance to be with him. It's no. Yeah. And to love him a lot when he was here. The last thing before we go tonight, remembering our friend Bob, we're sad to report it has been yet another tough day on Sesame Street. Bob McGrath, the show's friendly neighbor and music teacher, passed away on Sunday at his home in northern New Jersey. He was 90 years old. As one of Sesame Street's original cast members, his character, Bob Johnson, was gentle and kind, singing unforgettable songs to generations of young children and their parents for half a century. The Today Show Chanel Jones has a look back on Bob's incredible life. What is your job in the neighborhood? For over 50 years, Bob McGrath was a beloved person in a make-believe world of puppets on Sesame Street. We fold it over once again. Making his debut on the legendary children's program's pilot episode back in 1969. That's great, Big Bird. You know, all that practice is really paying off. McGrath portrayed music teacher Bob Johnson. Sharing the screen next to Sesame Street's Muppet characters for 47 seasons. Shout out loud can do. The professional singer turned actor performed some of the show's most memorable songs. Who are the people in your neighborhood? And this childhood staple. Sing. McGrath's family announcing he died at age 90, peacefully, surrounded by loved ones. I am your friend. I sure do care about you. His signature role on the groundbreaking educational program helped make the singer-turned-actor into an icon. Sesame Workshop honoring the founding cast member, writing in a statement, Bob embodied the melodies of Sesame Street like no one else and his performances brought joy and wonder to generations around the world. When you think of Bob McGrath, you think of someone who raised generations of kids to really be compassionate. He was someone who was there oftentimes for our parents, for us, and for our kids as well. McGrath leaving behind a legacy that will help future kids have sunny days for years to come. Behind Sesame Street, it was just a dream come true to fall into this job. Big Bird tweeted earlier today, thank you for always being my friend, Bob. I love you. And from all of us at 11th Hour, we'd like to say thank you for being our friend, Bob. We are grateful that we got the chance to get to know you and love you while you were here. And on that note, I wish you all a very good night. From all of our colleagues across the networks of NBC News, thanks for staying up late. I'll see you at the end of tomorrow.